Kate's got your <laughs> forecast as we are expecting some more snow headed our way. We are two storms to watch uh -huh. one Thursday into Friday, one Saturday into Sunday, but neither of these is a slam dunk snowstorm. In fact, some challenges as far as precipitation type. Are we talking rain? Are we talking snow? Likely it's going to be a little bit of both both storms. Let's start off with what's happening right now. We'll take you outside. Just a quick look at Center City. It's a quiet, clear night. Temperatures dropping pretty rapidly. As we showed you at the top of the broadcast, temps are already down in the 20s and teens and continuing to plummet into the early morning hours. So a frigid start to your Tuesday. A clear sky and a calm wind generally leads to extreme cold, especially with the fresh new snowpack on the ground. We got that this weekend, but it's a stretch of sunshine, at least for the next two days. We have a front that's approaching Approaching on Wednesday, that'll slip through pretty much unnoticed Wednesday night. It will tap into some colder air by Thursday. So the next two days, seasonably cold with highs in the 40s, lows in the 20s. That's about where we should be from mid to late January. Overnight, again, seasonably cold, 22 degrees, mainly clear. Tomorrow is a frigid start to the day, especially in areas like Millville, interior South Jersey, let's say, and up into the Lehigh Valley, where many spots will start in the teens. The afternoon high is a seasonable 40 degrees, and it looks like a most sunny and tranquil day. So maybe you can shed at least a few pieces of your full winter gear. Maybe you don't need the full face covering there. Just the gloves and the coat should get you through for the next two days with temps in the 40s. We knock down the temperature Thursday. You'll want to bundle up again and in some spots you may need to break out the snow boots late Thursday as our next system approaches. So two storms. One is weaker. It's a clipper system. Doesn't have a ton of moisture. This will come in late Thursday evening. Looks like just at the tail end or just after the evening commute Thursday and continue into Friday morning it starts as snow showers changing to rain showers overnight. Stronger storm though impacts the area Saturday evening into Sunday. This one has tons of moisture with it, likely snow changing to rain, then possibly to sleet and then possibly back to snow. Just looks like a messy winter slop storm here Saturday into Sunday as of now. So let's take a quick look at just one model. This is the European model. This first is the Thursday into Friday system. Again, it's not going to be this big shield of snow. Generally light scattered snow showers Thursday evening, changing over to rain showers most of the area overnight, possibly an inch or two north and west of the city, but mainly rain for Philadelphia. Then that's out of here. It's kind of a wintry finish to the week. Thursday night into Friday starts as snow or a mix, then changing to rain, but especially north and west, some slick travel Friday morning. Just an early look at the next system and what the models are trending toward today is a start as snow Saturday afternoon, changing to very heavy rain, possibly a couple of inches of rain overnight, and then back to a mix and back to some snow by Sunday evening. That will last likely a solid 24 hours over the weekend from Saturday afternoon through Sunday afternoon or evening. And as of now, again, it looks like a mix of precipitation types. Most likely scenario as of what our models are showing us today, snow to rain, then back to sleet and snow later Sunday as the storm moves away. So certainly want to look at your weekend plans now. Again, this doesn't mean we're going to see heavy snow out of this. It may be that the rain is the heaviest precipitation type, but it does look like it's going to be a messy weekend and really a messy finish to the week as well.